Good morning from Villa Vanuatu. Another beautiful scene to start the day off. Kind of like how it's got a little bit of like the fog and the clouds. <laughs> so pretty. It's got some beaches over there. This is a little more industrial. You can definitely tell there's a bunch of fishing boats. Um, there's like a fuel station down the other way. Um, just a little more uh, civilization at this one, but still beautiful views. So uh, today on the agenda, breakfast of course, and then going to head out, I am meeting with Eddie with some tours that were um, scheduled over like a Facebook group, but um, he runs a company here in town and there's quite a few of us um, from the Facebook group that are going to be using him, so we shall see what Eddie has to uh, offer and hopefully it's a great day here in the All right, so still standing here waiting for Eddie to get organized. Uh, you can definitely tell that they have not had cruise ship visitors for quite a while, uh, and they need a teacher's help to help organize. Uh, we're kind of organizing ourselves at this point. Uh, yeah, it's interesting, but I'll show you behind me. Like all of these people are here for tours, but it's like everyone showed up at the same time, and there's also no like stand here for this tour, stand here for this tour, or anything like that. So, we'll see how this improves, or if we change. Then we'll find this funny. We're at the gas station. If you know, you know. Alright, so on for stop with Teddy. I'm on tour, they call it number five. But the first stop is the chocolate factory. The tour started with a demonstration of how the chocolate is made. They get it from all different islands of the different cocoa beans. She was very informative. This was the beans before they roast them and then after they roast them and then after they are separated and shelled. They have a little like factory there on site, but we couldn't go in just because of safety things, but we got to see from the outside. And then the favorite part, it was taste testing. And then of course the gift shop, you know, you're going to end up in a gift shop. One of the main roads has construction. This guy literally jumped in front of the van to have a stop. There's fruit and veggie stands along the way, and then this is the entrance to the cultural village. Absolutely beautiful vegetation and uh, like green colors that you can't even catch on the camera. So we'll give you two of our music <laughs> and we like to give you you are my shine shine oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so if you know the song you can see <laughs>
Absorb the oxygen from the water, the fish cannot breathe. Yeah. Floating up. Yeah. Fastest way to kill fish. Nobody else wants to play with the spider. I don't know why. Farm, the form of bait. Yeah. Go up there. So once the pig saw the food, yeah. pull his mouth to eat the food, touch this piece of stick, this is a trigger. When you push this stick here, yeah. we'll swing the pig over. Hey. Hey. Uh, 
hold the stone. Good photo. Ready? One, two, three. Oh yeah. Very good. Very The kids were very interested in my light skin and my hair. Back to the man, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just like chilling it out. He's like, ah. All right, so we are at Turtle Bay now. And there's little baby turtles. They're so cute. They just got the cold iguanas. I guess uh, today's a wild night too. Sorry for the wind noise, but you know, when we're here is where you can actually swim with some of the turtles and like feed and pet them. Uh, as you can tell, it's pretty packed, but it's beautiful. Right, so we are at a stop for lunch right now, and it's right by the um, like Blue Lagoon, Blue Hole, whatever you want to call it. Uh, they do have a like buffet setting out kind of lunch. You know, I can't have it, so it's a bunch of um, meat, fruits and veggies, um, some chips, and then like a water jug. So we're good, <laughs> but uh, it's absolutely beautiful here. Luscious green. famous spaces so super super nice so far a great excursion minus the confusion at the port but um i mean it rectified itself in like 30 minutes so but uh, all the stops have been great i will say that like the touristy spots like the two uh the turtles um it was pretty crowded but it, it's to be expected so we finished our lunch which was just right back over here walking a quick little ways around like a uh, yard it is um, like uneven but it's fairly flat and it's fairly sturdy and then walk down just this little walkway and there it is i'll show you more when i get down there so i don't slip and fall here is the blue lagoon or the blue hole And there is a like, little like sidewalk deck here to stand on so that it's nice and stable. A little bit of seating. It's actually really nice because it's kind of shaded. duty-free store it's gonna have to be quick because we're running kind of short on time all right so another really quick stop because we're running out of time uh, here is like the little uh, hay market area um, it's just right on the way back to the ship so see if I can find what I need good evening from Carnival Splendor we just uh, left Villa and oh my gosh that excursion was amazing did it exhaust me? Yes. <laughs> yes, it did. It was a lot of stuff packed into one day, but I love how I got to see so much of Villa and just how their history came about in the city and all that kind of stuff. But I did come back and take a nap straight away because I was just that tired. But uh, let's see. So the stops, the chocolate shop, it was a lot of fun. Um, tasting all of the different ones and each island had a different flavor of cocoa bean which was really really interesting because they are made up of four or five different islands for their chocolate it's pretty cool and then after that went to the cultural visit visit and uh that was absolutely amazing 
Um, uh, starts off with a bang, I will tell you that, and that's all I'm going to say. Um, but so much history there, they were willing to explain everything and all that. Uh, the group I was in, um, it was kind of two different groups, so we had like a group of five and a group of four, and then there was me. So I made sure that they knew not to lose me <laughs> throughout the day, but then also it was kind of fun just to uh, talk to some Aussies and all that. But even they were like, oh my gosh, there's so much to do. And then, like, I was always the daring one, like, hand me the iguanas, hand me the spiders, all that kind of stuff. So it was a lot of fun. But uh, cultural visit, definitely A plus, two thumbs up, whatever you want to say. Uh, the uh, turtle bay, it was cool. Got to see turtles. I felt kind of bad for the turtles that were in the ocean, like where people go in like full body with them. Um, there was like four turtles maybe in there and it was like they were trying to run away. I felt really, really bad, um, but I got to see them. Pretty cool. But the um, like landscape out there was absolutely stunning again. Um, I could have just stayed out there and watched the waves the whole time. So uh, yeah, definitely stopped by there just to see the vistas and all that. Uh, the blue hole, the lunch looked really good. It's just I couldn't eat it. Um, just for safety precautions and then um, getting to actually see the blue hole or the blue lagoon was a lot of fun watching the kids do the rope swings and all that and none of those kids wanted to leave <laughs> like I was pretty sure that some parents had to drag their kids away but lots to do out there and it was definitely fun and then stopped at the two markets they were good but it was a kind of a frenzy to get there and get what you wanted and then get out just because we were kind of running short on time. But it was a good time, definitely fun packed, definitely exhausting, but the show must go on. So now let's go and hit maybe dinner. I'm not really hungry yet, um, but dinner and then the evening activities. I will see you around the ship while I continue to make those memories and not dream and live every day as a gift. That's what it is. See you around the ship. Hi, we want to see your biggest, sexiest, longest kiss ever. <laughs> Good night from Carnival Splendor. Fun filled day. The evening didn't disappoint either. They had Deal or No Deal, The Love and Marriage Show. There was bingo. I didn't go to bingo. Um, and then they also did a Grinch, Grinch Miss deck party. They called it something else, but it was a Grinch Miss um, deck party. It was very kid oriented, of course, but uh, they were having a lot of fun and then they got little like glow sticks and there was also face painting so they were all excited about that but all right afternoon today i'm exhausted i'm going to call it an early night and i will see you tomorrow while i continue to make those memories and not dreams and live every day's gift because that's what it is thanks to my heart donor see you around the ship